Hello, welcome back to the Bibs Booktube channel. My name is Kaylen slash Chewbacca today because I'm in this very like a furry fuzzy jacket and my hair is just curly and crazy today. So I'm like Kaylen slash Chewbacca, I guess. Anyways, welcome back to today's video. I am participating in the Spookathon and I'm so excited. I haven't been excited about a readathon in so long since basically booktubeathon really but i am so excited to do the spookathon this year and i didn't do a day one update because i didn't do any reading i was gonna sit down at midnight and start right ahead but i decided to go to bed instead and so far for day two i woke up bright eyed at 8 30 this morning which is weird because i don't do mornings i don't know what's more spookier like me waking up at 8.30 in the morning or this readathon, but I ended up waking up at 8.30 this morning and got a little bit of reading done, and so it's currently 11.30. Um, this is the total page count that I have so far for the day, and I'm currently reading Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, the illustrated edition. I am just loving the illustrations so much. I'm currently at the point where I'm going to start the Marauders map, and I am so excited, and I don't know what those pictures or illustrations are going to look like and I am just so excited. But anywho, I'm going to get some maybe more reading done. I did place a hold on a book at the library, which I should probably pick that up today because I did that yesterday and they're like, yeah, you can pick it up today. And so I'm a little bit behind on that. So I may go to the library. I have work later today, like in a couple of hours, and then that's going to consume most of my day. But once I get back home from work. I'm gonna sit down and relax and do plenty of reading and I can't wait for it. I'm just so welcome back to another update. It's currently eight eight o'clock lies. It's currently ten fifty at night. I am now just finally sitting down, relaxing and winding and reading Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Mask Man Illustrated Edition. Right now I'm about to start chapter 10, which is the Martyr's Map, and I am so excited. I'm so excited for this chapter. I can't wait to read it. Hopefully there's a map in here somewhere. I got to the part in the Marauder's Map where we indeed get a map. I wish it was like a full spread instead of just text over here. Like this whole thing could be the map, but I am happy with this half sheet of spread of map oh my god jazz fingers happy fingers i don't know what fingers are going on it is so pretty i just want to cry it is it is beyond it is beyond beautiful in my eyes and i am so glad it is a living thing that i didn't know i needed until now welcome back to morning and day three of the spook spookathon I did not get much reading done after last night. I ended up reading this wonderful, beautiful page next to this wonderful illustration. I wish it was a full spread, not just a page, but I'm content. I ended up flipping the page, reading this page, and stopping. So I got to 150, 151 last night, and I haven't read anything yet. I'm just so excited to be reading Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban because I love this book so much and the illustrations are so good and it's it has totally been worth the wait and I I'm just so excited but anyhow it's currently 10 a.m. in the morning I don't know the state of my hair right now it is probably very messy um, got that bed head rockin'. I threw on a sweatshirt that I was wearing last night. I want to read so much today and I cannot take this book out with me when I want to go and read later. I just don't want it to get dirty, dusty, fingerprinty, bent, damaged, broken, whatever. Like, this book is my child. I have today off. I have a couple things I need to get done. So right now I'm gonna read, finish up the Marauder's Map chapter, get ready, go do some errands and come back and read for the rest of today. And um, now that I think about it, I'm going to show you guys my TBR pile for the rest of the readathon. So here are the books I plan to read for the rest of the readathon. I really want to get to There's Someone Inside Your House next. It's pretty short and I just, I still need to read it because it's by Stephanie Perkins and I want to see what she can do with horror. 
Next up is Horror Store. Grady Hendrick. I thought this was gonna have, I picked this up from the library. I thought this was definitely gonna have more pictures in it, but it doesn't look like it has very many pictures at all. But it is a relatively short book. I think there's only like 241 pages. So it's a pretty short book. Hopefully I can get to that one as well, maybe. Next book is not a spooky read, but I just need, need to read it before the end of the month. And that is Aaron Bowman's Retribution Rails. It comes out in November and I just, I gotta read it so I can get my review done and everything else done with it. And if I get time... The last book that I want to get to with this readathon is The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer by Michelle Hodkin. I probably won't even get to this book, but I just want to make sure it's on that list. I get it done. If not this month, next month for sure. That is my TBR, and so I'm going to get back to reading and I'll update you guys soon. So welcome back to another update. The entire day I spent reading in this blue fuzzy chair in front of my window with the windows open, enjoying the nice fall weather and I actually got quite a bit of reading done from where I last left off. Let me see. I'm now on chapter 14, Snape's Grudge, which is page 204, but I'm like in the middle of the chapter, so I'm at like 210. So all this afternoon I've just been sitting and reading and relaxing. So this is what I have left to read of Prisoner of Azkaban. It's not a lot. I got that chunk all done. I just really want to take this book everywhere and read it, but I just don't want it to get dirty or damaged. But right now, I think that is going to be where I stop today with reading. This weekend, though, I plan on getting a lot of reading done since I have the weekend off and I'm so excited for it. I also plan to do a couple other things, but the main goal for the rest of the Spookathon is to just finish Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban and then move on to one of my next couple books that I have. I will not finish the next book, but I'll definitely finish Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. So I think that is going to be it for right now for part one of this vlog. And then I'm going to do like the weekend, the last couple of days of Spookathon vlog for next week. And that, that's where I'm going to lead off at right now. So anyways, that is going to be it for this part of the vlog. Part two is going to come out next week. So hit that subscribe button if you want to see the rest of my spookathon progress then. And anyways, it's going to be it for today's video. And then I'll see you for the next chunk of the spookathon vlog.